Hi guys, what's up and welcome to or welcome back to my channel. So today's video is super exciting. Recently I ordered a bunch of swimsuits from Shein and today we're going to be doing a little haul and a try on session. So I hope you guys are excited about this video. I've been looking forward to film this video since I placed this order. So I'm so happy the day has finally come. Before we get started though, I would love it if you would subscribe to my channel. I upload videos twice a week, Tuesdays and Sundays. So I would love to have you back here. Now let's jump into the first suit that I ordered. So I've been on the hunt for just a simple black swimsuit because surprisingly I don't have one and I feel like it's just a necessity and black swimsuits are so cute. So I found this one on Shein's website. Sorry, there's like something on here. I think it was like deodorant or something from when I first tried it on. I did wear this recently and though, but honestly you can't really tell when I wear it and it can come out if you just rub a little dryer sheet on that. But this is the swimsuit that I ordered and I think it is so cute. I'm a big fan of like this kind of deep V cut. I just think it looks so flattering on so many people. Personally, I don't have like a bigger chest. So these work pretty well with me. But honestly, on women and girls that do have a little bit of a larger chest, these swimsuits look super cute too. So if you fit into either category, I think that this would look really great on you. I just think it's such a flattering cut. The back of this doesn't have a clasp or a tie or anything. It just is straight elastic like this and honestly so I've ordered from Romwe before which is kind of like a very similar company to Shein and a lot of the bathing suits that I got from them were that kind of seamless edge it's kind of like when the seams are like tucked in like this kind of so it doesn't have this sort of harsh edge seam here and I find that a lot more comfortable than these ones so I was really hoping that the ones that I order from Shein would have that kind of seamless edge because just, I just think that they look better on me personally and I feel more comfortable in them but a lot of the ones that I ordered did have seams which I was kind of a little bit disappointed about but it's nothing too horrible. I ordered mine in a small. I think I got all of my swimsuits in a small. I probably could have fit into a medium too but some of them were saying they ran, ran a little bit big and some of them were true to size so I kind of just went with a small because I didn't want them to be too big and honestly a lot of bathing suits for me at least stretch out once I wear them in pool in the ocean too so I didn't want to have that problem so I just ordered them in a small and most of them fit pretty well um, and this one I think was around $13 I think all of them were around that price point I will check exactly and I will pop a picture of the price and what the swimsuits exactly are called up on the screen here and I will have everything linked down below too as well as Shein's website if you want to check out some of these suits or some other things that they sell on their website too but this is the first one that I ordered and it just looks so cute on the bottoms are just plain black and have that same like ribbed pattern like the top did and they are a little bit high waist and a little bit of a higher cut on the side. I actually posted a picture in this one over on my Instagram so you guys can see it over there too but I really really like this and I'm happy to finally have a black bathing suit in my bathing suit collection. Next up I ordered this one shoulder one and this one does have like the kind of seamless edge that I was talking about so that is kind of what it looks like and I just find this one is a lot more comfortable than the other ones but this is what it looks like it's kind of this like mauvey reddish rust color um I just think the color was super pretty I try to go with a pretty neutral theme for most of my bathing suits because I'm obsessed with browns and blacks and neutral colors um but this one does have a tie that goes kind of around your ribs here I will say though judging off of the picture I thought this tie was going to be a lot thicker and you will see in the try on clip too it kind of looks a little bit awkward um but I'm sure I can make it work somehow and if worse comes to worse I can always just cut it off right there but I think as long as you tie it kind of a little bit nicer than I did in the try on clip it will look a little bit better and once it kind of stretches out a little bit it might expand kind of so it doesn't look as thin and weird looking. The bottoms are just the same color and they are plain and they are a little bit high waisted. I will say with a lot of, oh they're inside out, um, with a lot of the, the bottoms especially I kind of wish I would have sized up because I like my high waist to be a little bit higher waisted than most of these ones are and I am really a big fan of like the kind of high cut swimsuit bottoms because I think they look a lot more flattering on me. I'm a little bit shorter so I just feel like that kind of elongates my legs a little bit and just overall looks a little bit better but I think these ones are super cute and they're really comfy too so this is another swimsuit that I'm really happy I picked up. Alright so this next swimsuit wasn't originally in my cart whenever I was kind of 
finalizing my decisions but I was watching some Shein hauls here on YouTube and I saw a few people order this swimsuit and it just looks so cute on them and it was very different and I'm obsessed with tie-dye right now and this was kind of like a neutral take on tie-dye so it is this brown and white tie-dye print bathing suit and I think it is so adorable so the top is just this plain like straight across top it is a little bit um like thinner here across the top which I think is kind of flattering it will honestly give you less of an awkward tan line than like your traditional tank toppy style swimsuits but the back is really cool because it doesn't tie or have a clasp or anything it kind of just cuts straight down on the side like this and just goes straight into this little back thing going on here and I think it's really flattering and I like the cut of it a lot and this will honestly look way better on me once I get a little bit more of a tan but I'm obsessed with this kind of color scheme here and the bottoms are kind of a little bit different they're more of a high cut style which personally I prefer I think these would be much better if they had the seamless edge but honestly it's still great quality for the price that you pay for all of these and you know you can't get too mad about it when you're ordering a $13 bathing suit off a website it's such a deal but these are the bottoms they aren't really high-waisted but they do come up a little bit higher on the hips so it kind of gives a little bit of that high-waisted effect and they are pretty comfortable as well I think once these ones stretch out a little bit once I actually wear them in the water they will fit perfectly and this is another one that I am obsessed with all right next up I thought this one was going to look a lot cuter on me than it actually did. It looked really cute on the model, but obviously she was a model and I'm not a model, so kind of have to take that into consideration, but it is this kind of red, tan, and black color block sort of print. I really thought that this red, it's kind of coming off a little bit brighter on camera than it is in person, but on their website it kind of looked a little bit more of like a rust color, which is what I kind of wanted it to be, but honestly it doesn't look bad with the red anyways. Um, but this is just your traditional like tank top sort of style swimsuit top, and it is pretty comfortable. It doesn't have a clasp or a tie or anything in the back, which is honestly kind of helpful if you're going to be wearing it to the beach or playing pool games or something like that. The top does fit me really nicely and I really like the top. The only thing is my I'm a little bit paler now. I haven't really been out in the sun too, too much. So this tan kind of blends in a little bit on me, especially on the bottoms, which you will see in the try-on clip. But these are the bottoms. They are high-waisted and they're not really like a high leg cut which is what I was really hoping they would be and honestly the sides are a little bit of an awkward placement at least on my body it would be a lot better if the leg hole was a little bit bigger and the hips went a little bit farther up but I think with some gentle stretching and just loosening up it will probably look a little bit better on me as time goes on the only gripe with the only gripe that I have with this right now is kind of just the coloring because this part here since it doesn't have any like black band around it or anything like the top does it kind of blends in my skin blends in with my skin a little bit too much and isn't the most flattering on me right now but I think once I get a little bit more of a tan the color of my skin and the color of the bathing suit top here will kind of be contrasting enough that it won't look as bad but ultimately I really like this bathing suit I think it is pretty comfortable it has like this ribbed pattern as well the only other thing with this is um it has like these little holes right here where you can remove the pads and since the top color is so light when you put it on sometimes you can see like the little hole if you don't have the pad down far enough but I, honestly it's really nice that you can remove the pads too because I know some people don't like to wear them and some bathing suits I don't really like them either but all of the ones so far and all of I think all of the ones that I'm going to show you they all have built-in pads and I think all of them are removable too which is really nice. Next up is probably one of my favorite bathing suits that I own and definitely one of my favorites out of this haul. So it is this leopard and black one piece. It's going to be a little bit hard for me to show you because it has very very long strings but you will get a better idea in the try on clip. So this is what it looks like and these are this the strings and <laughs> they're super long and they're still tied in a knot from me trying them on but basically with the strings what you do is you crisscross them in the back and then they wrap around your waist two times and then you can just tie them in the back and honestly this one is like the comfiest material out of all the ones I ordered they still it still has like 
this very seamed edge which I'm not the biggest fan of but the material is very very soft and very comfortable to wear um, this one I was a little bit on the fence about like I thought it was really cute on the model but I didn't know how wide this boob part would be um, I've tried on a bathing suit like this before from Aerie and honestly this part was just way too skinny that I did not feel comfortable in it I felt like I was gonna have a nip slip every time I moved my arm but being that this one has straps that you can actually tie yourself um, it kind of makes it a little bit better because you can make it super tight around that area and it doesn't feel like it's going to budge or anything. Obviously, I wouldn't really wear this in the ocean or if I was going to be playing like pool games or something or if I knew I was going to be doing a lot of swimming. This is more of just like a lounging, taking pictures bathing suit. But I do feel a lot more comfortable and secure in this bathing suit than I have in ones that have been like a similar cut in the past. But I really, really enjoy this one. This one does have built-in pads too and you can also take them out if you desire. I would say though, I got this in a small. It is pretty good lengthwise, but I do have a shorter torso. So if you have a bigger chest, I would definitely recommend sizing up because you do want these to be a little bit bigger. Like I'm not, I have a pretty flat chest and this almost feels like it's a little bit too, too skinny for my chest. So if you do have a larger chest size, I would definitely recommend sizing up because you, you kind of want to be a little bit more <laughs> secure there. I mean, maybe you don't want to, but I would assume that most people want their chest not exposed. <laughs> Next up is one that I basically ordered for the top. Like I said before, I'm a big fan of like those sort of thicker tank top strap swimsuit tops that have the deep V and this is exactly that and I absolutely love the color of it. It keeps coming unclasped in the back because it kind of doesn't stay too securely when it's not on my body but you will see it a little bit better in the try on clip but I am obsessed with this color. I love the kind of burnt orange metallic. I just think it is so pretty and it will look gorgeous with a little bit more of a tan and just I'm obsessed with it but I love this swimsuit cut I think it is so flattering I'm not gonna go through the whole spiel again because it's basically the same as the first swimsuit that I showed you minus the larger band on the bottom that the black one had this one also does have a little clasp in the back as you can see and this one has adjustable straps so it's a little bit more forgiving than just like the first black one that I showed you that wasn't adjustable at all um, but I basically ordered it for this top because I just fell in love with it when I saw it. The bottoms I was a little bit iffy about because they have this like really tight band here at the top and I ordered mine in a small because I thought the top would fit me in a small because I don't have a super big chest like I've said a million times in this video. I wanted to get it in a small so that it wouldn't be too big on me but because all of the Shein swimsuits come as a set sometimes they sell some singles and you can get lucky enough to find the top that you want in like just a single top and so they'll sell the bottom separately sometimes but most of the swimsuits on there are sold as sets so you can't pick a different size top and bottom. Um, so anyways I bought it mostly for the top because I figured I could wear it with black bottoms if I chose to and these bottoms just I didn't think they would be very flattering on my body because they are a small I was very hesitant with this super tight band here how it look how it would look around my waist I just felt that this would just suck my sides in way too much and just look it would make me look too pudgy so I just kind of wanted to avoid the bottoms at all costs and honestly when I first tried them on, I totally felt that way, but the more that I put them on, I feel like they're loosening up a little bit that on my good days where I'm feeling a little bit more fit than usual, I could probably get away with wearing these bottoms and feel a little bit more comfortable in them. But yeah, I'm just not the biggest fan of this sort of like underwear-y elastic band style bottom. It will definitely look cute on some people and I just don't think I'm the right person to wear this. Maybe someday, maybe I will put them on this summer if I if I choose to but mostly I ordered this bathing suit for the top however I think it is a very very cute set and this one has the the um pads that you can remove as well and I just think it is really adorable and I love the color all right moving on to our last swimsuit of the day this one is probably in my top two for swimsuits that I ordered in this haul so this is this kind of like tribally yellow print bathing suit and I fell in love with this immediately when I saw it. The model that it was on on Shein's website had such a gorgeous tan going and this just looks so pretty against her skin color 
and honestly I, I want that to be me so I ordered this one and I am a little bit pale for it now so it does look not as good as I want it to but I think towards mid to end of summer when I do get a little bit more of a tan I think this will look so pretty the good thing also about this is this one shoulder goes over this shoulder my left shoulder and then the other one shoulder one that I ordered is over my right shoulder so hopefully this will kind of even it out a bit my tan lines um, but I'm obsessed with this pattern. I think the yellow color is so pretty and I like the like brown detail in it too. It's like three of my favorite colors in a bathing suit. This one is a little bit longer as you will see in the try on clip. It kind of comes down and almost meets the top of the um, back of the bottoms in on my back. I don't know why I said that so weirdly, um, but I do have a shorter torso, so if you are a little bit taller, it probably won't do that on you. I just think it's because this top is a little bit more of like a long line top and the bottoms are for sure high-waisted. These are the bottoms and they match exactly. I got this one in a size small as well. These are a very comfortable material too. They are very soft and kind of silky feeling. Um, the bottoms could use, at least for my preference, to be a little bit more of like the high cut leg, but I just, I think it's really cute anyways and because the waist is a little bit higher on these ones than the other ones it kind of gives that illusion too so it's not like it needs to be too much higher but this one is super comfy and I can't wait to wear it throughout the rest of the summer and it just feels like such good quality for the price that it was. So those were all of the swimsuits that I have ordered from Shein. There might be another haul coming in the future from either Shein or Roman because I've been looking at some more bathing suits. Not like I need any more because this is plenty for the whole summer and probably next summer too, but I'm just a bathing suit gal. So I always love ordering a whole bunch and finding a bunch of great deals on swimsuits when summertime rolls around. But I hope you guys enjoyed this swimsuit haul. Like I said, I will put all of the exact links for all of the suits that I ordered down below in the description box. And I will also put a link to just Shein's general site down below too if you want to check out some of their other swimsuits or some of the other things that they sell on there. There's also an app too if you want to download that. That's what I use to do all of my shopping on Shein. It's really easy to use and I just find it a lot easier than going on the internet every single time. But if you guys are looking for some affordable yet pretty good quality swimsuits, I would definitely recommend checking out Shein. They have so many unique ones on there and they just have so many on their site in general. You'll be browsing for hours, so definitely a lot, a large chunk of time in your day to check out all of their swimsuits. Um, I definitely recommend it, but thank you guys so much for sticking around to the end of this video with me. I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope that you will subscribe to my channel. Like I said, I upload videos twice a week, Tuesdays and Sundays, so I'd love to see you back here, and I can't wait to see you in my next one. Bye.